down lawn mowing services dot info all right so if you know me you know i've built thousands of websites in my career and i've really you know done a bunch of different case studies using a bunch of different factors and variables and i'm trying to figure out now with with everyone and you'll see it in, in real time as i do these videos breaking down different successful sites that i own of what factors work so if you've seen my other videos i'm really big on expired domains so this particular site is a brand new dot info site in terms of it was brand new when i bought it it wasn't an age domain or expired you know from an, another business that had a link profile it had zero links, zero trust flow, zero everything. Um, I also built this particular site using CityPage Pro, which is one of the several mass page builders that I use, and CityPage Pro happens to be one that I built. Um, and then I also use Black Hat links to do the linking. So those are the factors for this particular one. Uh, a couple things to note is that we built this site back in 2000, uh, sorry august of 2019 so the site's about 14 15 months old if my math is correct uh, and you'll see here i noticed back in june that i didn't have stack counter on it somehow we got missed um so we threw that on there and we saw okay great the site was doing good i actually i think i was searching for another site and i saw this one pop up and i was like i own this site because it's, it's it's funny i'll definitely end up putting more energy into this video about the site than i did to build it so uh put that fact out there that's pretty crazy so uh, you'll see here just in the six months that we have uh, stats for it's over 5300 unique visits and plus what you don't see here as well is spring spring is nuts for this site uh, I mean we're getting like two three hundred visits a day so I bet you this was more like 15,000 but whatever 5,000 is enough in six months you can see um, and here's a the spike here for the fall cleanup in any event so let, let's kind of break down um, like people who don't know about kind of my background. So 2008 to 2016, I was a prolific SEO affiliate, essentially. Uh, and I built out thousands of sites. And this was back when mass page sites, no one else was really doing it. Uh, and it was like shooting fish in a barrel, making just millions of dollars. And uh, it was so, so easy. Unfortunately, with the Google Penguin and Panda and all the updates and a lot more competition, um, this style of making sites and making money has, has been greatly um, reduced in its potency compared to like 2012, et cetera, in the golden days. But this still makes a lot of money. And, and the difference now in 2020 is these visitors are worth so much more money than they were back then. So there's some, you know, things to of relative comparison that you've got to take into account. Because a lot of people ask, well, why are you going to teach this? Well. My business now has changed. I'm an affiliate network and we're doing phenomenal with that. I still have a VA that builds sites. I still have probably 80 to 90 legacy website sites that I built back in the day that are still doing well today. Um, and we're still building sites every day. I have one VA that cranks out sites, maybe 15, 20 sites a week. Um, and I'm teaching everyone how to build City Page, City Page Pro, SERP Farm, SERP Shaker, um, and how to rank and how to then monetize that traffic. Uh, and hopefully you'll monetize it with LeadSmart. So then it's a win-win for everybody. So let's get into the site first. So let's, let's start. There's a lot to go over. We need to go over what City Page Pro is, how that works. And, and this is for the people who don't even know kind of what SEO is. When people ask me like, hey, Matt, can you look at my site for SEO? I don't care what your site looks like first. First, I want to see site colon the website okay and this is showing me what that's going to show you is how many pages are indexed in google and then i'm also going to see what the title tags are so your meta titles these blue links the, the words that are there are the most important elements for each individual web page that's online this is how you tell the search engines this is what my page is about you only have a certain amount of characters that you can use here so you've got to really be you know particular you're going to leave out words like the and and in any you really want to hit for all the words that matter okay so if we look at this here we also see that I have zip codes I love zip codes so people search for zip codes a ton especially closer to city centers like Los Angeles Chicago New York they have hundreds of zip codes within one city so that's it's heavily used in search is zip codes also I have some theory that this is going to also help like on just nearby searches so when someone just searches like landscaping companies and maybe they're on Bartlett and on their phone it will show because I've seen some things in my stats that I don't understand how they got to me not using a keyword modifier so in any event 
let's look, let me show you how this places. Now zip code is a lot less competition. I'm already sure this is gonna place. And there it is, that's awesome. What is that, a couple under the map? Number five, I mean, that's awesome. Uh, we can search where I looked earlier. Now with the city name, you don't you don't place as much, especially this site, and I haven't paid any attention to this site. If I really wanted to pound this site and get it placing, I would do it. But the purpose of this video is to show you that I spent 20 minutes building this site. Not even, I, I built it, my VA built it, who knows? I don't even know, I haven't looked, I've looked this thing two times in a year that I've had it. The point is, such little effort and money went in to build something that takes up all of this virtual real estate. And this virtual real estate is valuable and it's easy to get. You can't go get land like this in the real world, but this, the digital real world, you can get land. Uh, let's see where we're at. There it is. So Eden NC landscaping, pretty nice. Uh, let me go back to this part of the one um, and show you just kind of how these sites work. All right, so this is the city page. It looks it looks decent on mobile, but again, this is I didn't put any effort into this. I could make this on a nicer template and make it look nicer. Again, I don't know if I mentioned it already. My my main business is my affiliate network. Making money from SEO websites is great, but I more want to learn uh, or teach what's working. Learn actually what works best for me, and then teach everyone to just do that and, and minimize mistakes. Let's look at this particular site. So this is the home site, the home page. You'll see here. It's a directory style, meaning we have the states, and then we have the cities, right? All the cities, and then we have the city page, okay? Now the city page, this does all the SEO work, okay? You hover there, Addison, Illinois, landscaping companies, whoa, landscapers, lawn care, and mowing, right? That's my whole meta title. You couldn't see it there before. Search engines only will read so much of it, I mean, that, I'm, I'm within reason there. Um, in any event, I've got just some basic SEO going on. Addison, Illinois, landscape service, Addison, Illinois, zip code. I've got some additional keywords here, et cetera, et cetera. So, uh, and then what, this is what makes City Page Pro different than everything else. Now, in order to make, we've had how many pages here? Probably 5,000 pages, right? And each page is the, essentially sharing the same template. So how, do the each, how does each page become unique without you having to write text for each individual city page? So that is taken care of by the listings that are ported in. So if we compare Addison, Illinois to like another city, they're not gonna have all of this content. All of this content is landscaping and Addison. So it's relevant content and it's a unique collection of it on this particular page. Now, yes, are these elements all the same up here with the exception of us swapping out Addison? Yes, it is, but so much of this page is filled with content that's relevant to Addison landscaping. And if we were to go to Bartlett, which is the town right next door, now you're gonna get all the Bartlett. These, these cities are literally sister brother sister cities are right next to each other but now I have all this different content that's feeding in and you can control how many pages how much you want to show here a couple things here to note so there's a downfall with city page pro that I will not uh, you know even though it's my software what are the downfalls of it the downfall is a lot of people will come and interact with these business listings okay and also these business listings are going to index right and people are going to find them and they're going to call that business which is not going to make you any money so to handle that there's a couple things that we're doing one we're making the upgrade so this all of this stuff can be hidden i didn't mention this featured listing here is us as well so we're the featured one but all of these are going to be hidden in a box that says view more listings it's still going to be shown to google they're going to still see all that content, but the end user is only going to see all of this and the featured listing, and then there'll just be a button there, which is really nice. So that should be ready. I'm doing a training video on this, how to build these. Uh, 10, uh, the 25th, I think, is the date. Uh, yeah, Wednesday the 25th, so 10 days from now. That feature should be already in there. Um, the other thing is I have affiliates who are utilizing this, and they use a cloak and redirect software so that when... A real visitor comes, they're sent to this really nice landscaping land page or HVAC plumbing, just a really nice landing page. If a bot 
um, comes to the page, it's shown this. So it still just sees the content. That's a little more black hat, but I've seen, I have affiliates that have year, year and a half old sites. They're using the Cloak and Redirect, excuse me, and there's no issues whatsoever. So again, black hat, who cares? It's a dollar, two, dollar to ten dollar URL plus a little time to build the site. If the site makes you money because you're using some black hat techniques and then it goes away, then big deal. You build more of them, build a hundred more of them. Um, while you do some white hat stuff, you know, I, I, I just don't subscribe to having any rules with Google. They're not the government and I'm going to break every rule I can get away with with it. You know, as long as I'm not breaking any laws, right? Um, so back to this, let's look at the Site Explorer on Majestic and just get an idea in terms of what type of linking I've done. So we'll see here is a trust flow of zero and a citation flow of 19. So traditionally, trust flow is a better metric. So the higher the trust flow, generally, the better the, um, the site. Uh, and then also the traditional thought is that if trust flow and citation flow are close to each other, so like 19 and 19, that's even better. But this kind of dispels some of that, right? So this is a zero and a 19. And then let's look at my spammy ass links. Look at this, Chinese links here. Uh, nothing against China. I'm just saying they're just traditionally known as, as spammy. Um, you know, so here's some other foreign stuff. And let's let's look at backlinks. There we are. So these are my backlinks. They're all just naked backlinks, which is just coming straight to. Uh, it looks like I linked out USA Land. So I linked out the category page here. So in any event, like I said, I, I'll end up putting way more effort into this. 10 minute video and then uploading it, maybe equal effort, right? That I did build in the site. Um, if I really cared about it, I'd come back, I would probably make a cloak and redirect or I would, you know, I don't know, make this landing page look a little nicer, but I don't. And I really care more about figuring out what's working, what's getting, you know, cause it's all about this. This is what, this is all I care about. This is all you should care about too. Because you can always do design, you can always make it prettier, you can always work on all the other stuff after you have placement. And some sites don't place, some sites will work and sometimes don't, they'll play. So um, again, we've got 34, 3500, city pages indexed, pretty much all of them should be pla placing for zip code and lawn mowing. That's what I saw tons of hits from. Yep, there it is. So like any, you know, thousands of zip codes. Let me just try mine. Lawn mowing, took that shit over. Boom, there it is. And that's awesome. So imagine this. Now I built one with very little effort. I'm gonna build, now I'll get some expired ones. I'll build like 10 sites and just own it. You'll own some of these searches. Um, there's no reason, that's how we used to do it. We used to call force search through us. So when someone would search like nine of the 10 results were our sites. They spammed the hell out of the SERP results and they would force people to have to visit our website. So in any event, I wanna see people build thousands of these sites. Let's spam the shit out of Google together. Let's build some awesome properties, you know? And again, I, I kid around, I say spam, but what you could do, like I'll give you an example, what if one of my better sites, so site colon 24hourdental.net. You can see here, we, we built this not with SERP Farm or SERP Shaker or City Page Pro. We built this with our own PHP like program. But again, it was just cranking out thousands of pages with business listing on it. It was like the first private version of City Page Pro essentially. But we realized that we the site was making us a ton of money and it made total sense for us to just um, put this into something nicer. And so we put it into a brilliant directory, which is a real true directory style software not, you know, and it makes these nice city pages and these nice business listings. Um, so it's, it's pretty cool, pretty cool. So, but City Page Pro essentially does the same thing for you and, and dire Brilliant Directories is pretty expensive. Um, and Brilliant Directory, it takes a lot more work to make it. So uh, I just wanted to just show you this, this one point here that you can, you can do other stuff with these sites in terms of after. You can also just keep them on WordPress and redesign them. But um, yeah, so. That's pretty much it we're gonna go over. In terms of how much money the site makes, it's really, you know, I haven't monetized this site that well at all. I can look at the records to see how many calls it got, but obviously I could make the site better. I could add chat to it. I could add, I think I have the form. Um, I could add the call now button. I could redesign it, 
it, but I don't give a shit. Um, you know, what it, it's more just to show you guys sites that, um, in this case, this is a dot info, right? It's a brand new URL. We did black hat links, and um, that's it. All right. Um, and we use CD Page Pro. And let's just go get black hat links. Let me show you guys. We'll wrap this up. Black hat links. Okay, so this is black hat links. I don't. I've used this guy forever. Um, I've never had an unnatural link penalty. Now I don't put all my sites on Search Console, but I've put probably a thousand, fifteen hundred on uh, Search Console out of everything I've built, and I've hit all types of fucking penalties. Um, not ever with. Uh, I'll tell you this: never with Serp Firm, never with City Page Pro. So that's cool. But Serp Shaker have got penalties. Um, other programs that we built, we've got penalties but never a link penalty, never on any of them. And I've used Black Hat links on almost everything. So this is what I go, I go to, I bought everything on this guy's list. I've spent a lot of money here. Uh, I use quality backlinks. This seems to do the biggest bang for a buck, right? 20,000 backlinks for $46, it's awesome. I, I've talked about this in other videos. Um, setting up Black Hat links, I'll probably just do a whole nother video on how to set that up, uh, on how to set the links is pretty easy, and some tips and guides, but aside from that, man, uh, and girls, guys and girls, that's all I got. So, um, if you're gonna build sites, you could buy, I've got the City Page Pro 50 bucks a month, so, that's where we're gonna end. Let me end on this. ADD is a mofo. Here we go. So, I was conflicted about selling City Page Pro. I need to log out there, sorry. All right. So, before I was conflicted about selling City Page Pro and then having them become affiliates and then making money from them, and I saw some affiliates were only making, like, you know, they built a few sites and maybe were making, like, 50, 60 bucks a month, and then they were getting charged 75 bucks a month or whatever it was we were charging. Um, so they were losing money, but I was making money. I'm making money on the software and I'm making money from their leads that they're sending us. So that, that, that didn't sit right for me. So uh, we'll go down to here on the, on the bottom here. So this is this is the cool thing. So 50 bucks a month, this is the City Page Pro Unlimited website pack, plus you get uh, the super value pack with it. And so that's unlimited websites. Uh, you get access to exclusive paper call offers to monetize your site. So there's People who work with me know I've got more than I show on Ringba and LeadSmart and I'll work directly with you when things make sense, right? Where I can bring you a direct client or a group of clients that you can work directly for uh, through LeadSmart. So you'll get exclusive stuff to that. Um, and anyone gets that who's in LeadSmart. So if you're part of LeadSmart, you get some of this uh, exclusive one-on-one -on -one with me. Uh, training and support on this whole thing. Um, the plugin pack, so you get two bonus mass page builders. Um, Okay, I won't name who they are, but you get two additional mass page builders. I'll give you some templates and themes to build. Uh, you get direct access to me, which is awesome. You get the case study access, which are these videos. And I actually show, you know, one on one, I'll show you a whole lot more uh, in terms of what works and what doesn't work. And if you're trying to build a certain site, what my history has been within keywords and sites that I've had that have done well. So cool stuff like that. Uh, unlimited updates, so like I said, we're always updating City Page Pro. Not always. I plan to start doing more updates to City Page Pro, and I, that was all included. And then this is the best part. So, fifty dollar per month rebate for Lead Smart affiliates. Okay, so if you earn more, so if you're invoicing me for twenty five dollars or more uh, in leads, you'll also be able to get you'll get a fifty dollar rebate, or you can add fifty dollars onto your invoice. So that's awesome. So right, so you buy the software for fifty bucks a month. You earn $25 in Lead Smart uh, affiliate commissions, and you'll get a $50 rebate for your um, for the City Page Unlimited website super pack. So you can't get better than that, right? I, I'm really not doing this to make money. Um, I would need you know a ton of subscribers to actually make some decent money. It's more to put skin in the game. I've been giving out this stuff for free, and then no one does anything. Like one out of ten people do anything. So if, if that's going to be you know the scenario, pay for it. I guarantee. Almost everyone's going to do something if they have to pay 50 bucks a month. Uh, at least build a handful of sites so you can make your 25 bucks and get your 50 bucks back for free. So, all right. If you have any questions, I'll drop the links in the comments and the descriptions. And uh, subscribe, right? That's what you say. Hit the subscribe button below, right? Hit that shit for me. Let's go. All right. Thanks, guys. And girls. Bye-bye.